Counterweight trebuchets were for centuries one of the most powerful types of siege engines to be used on battlefields and was only with the introduction of gunpowder that they eventually became obsolete. They are large catapults that are thought to have first been used in the 11th or 12th century and are made up of a long throwing arm, which has on one end a counterweight and on the other is a rope that holds the ammunition. They were fixed weapons, so had to be constructed close to enemy fortifications, but once this was done, they had the ability to launch huge projectiles a surprising distance. When triggered, the counterweight would drop down and cause the lever arm to lift up which in turn hurled the projectile with frightening force and accuracy. The forces on the device that would be exerted meant that it had to be solidly built often with an A-frame on either side to hold the arm and a counterweight in place. This meant that the full-size trebuchets weren't always practical to use, with armies often choosing to go with smaller catapults instead. But when there were large fortifications to contend with, there was nothing anywhere near as effective. For a defending army, the mere sight of seeing a trebuchet being constructed often meant the need to organize a suicide mission, with the hope that they could somehow destroy before it could release even one payload. Subscribe for more videos like this and turn on the notification to help the channel out. Thanks for watching.